All right, welcome back to the second week of the experiment, the science experiment. I'm not expecting much to have changed in just a week, but we can find out. So, here we are. So, have a look, so we're starting at the, uh, at this end. And uh, what we got? I'm trying to see if there's anything growing. What's that? Uh, nope, that's just something falling off a tree. It's these, these are uh, mini cherries that have fallen off before they've had a chance to grow. Because we're under a cherry tree, of course. Uh, I'm not going to take that off because it doesn't look like much is happening here either. Ah, <laughs> right. So didn't mention this last time, but uh, we set up all the holes, and then we realised down here there was a. Uh, some sort of animal hole. We weren't sure whether it was in use, so we thought, oh, we'll put one of these pots over and see what happens. And as you can see, it has, whatever animal lives in this little hole, has eaten through the, um, the pot, the biodegradable pot. So I think that probably means this, <laughs> uh, this, this uh, plot has been compromised because I don't know, how it's how the animal is going to get out. I guess it can burrow underneath the cage, but I assume anything that's going to grow in here is going to be eaten by uh, whatever animal that is. All right, let's have a quick look at this. I'm not seeing much here. I think we need to wait another couple of weeks, and then let's look at the final one. Again, not much has happened. So yeah, pretty brief video this week. We'll be back next week or maybe the week after. I'm not sure, I won't be here next week, but maybe Hester and Richard can do something. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you in the next video.